Hey everybody, it's Quick Wrench here at you. Just gonna do a quick little review. Slash tool haul. I picked up this year some coke and nut grip sockets. I've been using them since uh, about February. And what I think about them. It's a quarter inch drive set. So far, they've been exce exceptional. Definitely a great alternative to a magnetic socket. They do not seem to pick up the dirt. So far, none of them have wore out. They all still retain very well. For instance, that's a 17 mil. They have a little ball detent and a spring-loaded ring around it. So it's positive engagement. The socket does not fall out. Definitely a great alternative to a magnetic socket especially if you're working with something that's non-magnetic, such as plastic, titanium, whatever. As you can see, it holds the whole rail. So far, very impressed. In fact, it's so strong, it pulls it off the rail. Very impressed with these so far. I'll have to say I enjoy these much more than my magnetic sockets, although these are not impact rated. Have I used them on an impact? Of course I have. And the next tool to talk about is this a product by Schlaley Tool. It's part number is 15900. It's got two hammer th heads on it. And it is designed to, and everybody's used an extension as a hammer before. This is designed to go on your extension and be like an extended extension for your hammer. So you hammer right here, and then you have your hammer side there. In other words, it won't damage your extension, but yet it's still a solid way to extend a hammer into a tight to reach area. Also a very good product. A little pricey, I think. I mean, I guess not in today's world. It's probably around 50 bucks for that. The Coke and sockets, I will have to say, their bite, their grip, they are set and finished. They don't have that beautiful, nice, shiny chrome that you're gonna see on a snap-on chrome nickel-plated socket. They're matte finish, which I actually do like, but their grip, I would say, is equal to that of uh, a flank drive that snap-on produces. Definitely high-quality socket. And I think you can get this set for probably right around between 80 and 90 bucks and this set is an 8 through 19 with no skips now my quarter inch drive set is a 7 8 10 12 13 and 14 so there is a skip of the 11 and 9 mil but in japan on japanese cars 11 and 9 mil are like very uncommon and I will talk about one more tool set that I did pick up this year this is all stuff this is not one tool haul it's all stuff I picked up throughout the year and I have been using and I'm reviewing I also decided to pick up a set of thin wrenches this is a full set of Capri thin wrenches that runs from six mil to 24 mil on the metric side and a quarter inch to three quarters of an inch on the standard side. And so far, the chrome plating, they're made in Taiwan, the chrome plating is phenomenal on them. I have used these. I mean, it's not something you use often but there are uses for this. There are times you will need a thin wrench. And so far, I'll have to say for the money, I think this set's about $120. For the money, they've held up phenomenally. Um, I'm sure the Snap-on set is better, but probably comes at a cost of about probably, probably $400 to $500. I think for the 120 here, this is definitely a good set. Um, highly recommend this set from Capri Tool. As I said, you're, it's not a thin wrench is something we're not going to use very often. So, 
So with all that, quick wrench is up. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe, and I'll catch you in the next one.